Hi, this is Cheryl for Cut at Home. Today I have a really fun project for you featuring the accordion fancy label dies from Elizabeth Craft Design. These are just a super, super fun and versatile set of dies that you can use in many, many different ways. You can see the card pictured on the panel here shows a three panel card but you can do as many panels as you want so my project for you today is a 12 days of christmas fun fold um, card and i apologize you can't get it all in camera here getting a little stuck um, that features that die again you can use as many or as few as you want as few as two as many as 14 or even beyond to create a wonderful little project. Let me set it here in the background while I show you how that works better. Um, you start out with a piece cut like this. That is your page. It's one single page. You cut as many of these as you need. Um, it's always a good idea to keep the flap that you'll fold under for the next one always to the right so that you don't get lost as well as these little tabs. Those two go together if they're always to your right then you can't confuse your pages and misassemble your book. You can see on this one I've already started a fold on it and I've applied some score tape to those areas. Before we can begin to assemble the book though we need to decorate the panel. So each of the panels needs to be decorated first. There's a number of ways that you can do that. In the die set you're provided with the main panel as well as a set of accordion, I'm sorry, a set of the label dies that you can layer to create a design or a pattern. There's also a supplemental set that coordinates with the dies. It's called um, label frame edges. This gives you three different sets of frames that you could put around to decorate as well. And let me show you how I use that here on the 12 days of Christmas. I'm trying to open this up and it's not working very well for me. Um, you can see on this first page I had a black background and so I chose the scalloped border to decorate with and then when it all folds up that folds to the inside but it's still decorated. You could decorate certainly both sides and that's probably what I should have done in this project. Um, so you're going to decorate with this. I simply cut one of the layers to put inside to add some photos and that sort of thing. Um, then when you're ready to assemble after everything's decorated, your first fold of the pages is going to be down so your flap gets folded up. You simply remove the liner tape and attach your second page there. Once those are um, together in that manner, we're going to fold up our labels on both sides because the labels are going to go um, up on this and again the tabs will attach to the one next door allowing you to create the folds that you see in my finished project here. So super super simple to do. Very very easy. The hardest part is figuring out how many do you need and how to decorate it. I think you can find so so many uses for this particular die. I think it would be a fun way to send kids school photos to grandma and grandpa for example. Lots and lots of uses. Now to finish this off as you'll see on my blog post I just simply tied it with a ribbon and added a little Christmas decor. It's very very easy and a fun gift for the holidays. Thanks for watching.